certain arrhythmias though that we can actually fix completely. If it's one spot, you might hear about things called SVT. SVT is, is when there's one spot in your heart that goes bad. We can obviously, as long as it's in a safe spot, I can cauterize it, it's fixed, it's cured. Whereas atrial fibrillation, because there's so many spots, it's different. Now, go ahead and play that. This is a different technology. It's called cryoablation. Cryo is freeze. So sometimes we have to cauterize, sometimes we freeze in the heart. And um, the advantage sometimes of the freeze technology is that it's a little bit easier on the patient because you don't have as much inflammation in the heart and it, um, it helps uh, the recovery process. Uh, so certain arrhythmias um, for atrial fibrillation especially, we sometimes use the cauterization, sometimes we use the freeze. So we pick that based on where the short circuits are and such. But again, the biggest challenge for me is there are some areas that I cannot fix. This is one of the newest technologies that we brought to Arkansas. Uh, we are probably the only, only hospital in the state um, and in some of the surrounding states that has access to this particular technology called Pulse Field. It is the newest way that we're fixing atrial fibrillation um, where we actually go into the heart and we find these areas, you can play that. We find these areas with these specific wires that have, again, they, they look, they, they, they find the electrical uh, areas that are abnormal, but the beauty of this system is that it is very specific to the heart tissue. So it does not damage the surrounding tissues, which is what has been one of the biggest challenges for us, because when we affect the surrounding structures, then it causes complications. So this helps us minimize the complications and minimize any unnecessary tissue that, that gets affected. So. Um, this particular technology is something that we actually just started doing as part of clinical trial. Uh, that is one of the other things. You know, we do a lot of uh, research, a lot of new clinical trials at the Heart and Vascular uh, Institute. So that helps us bring some of these new technologies to uh, Arkansas and to Northeast Arkansas because otherwise some of these technologies take a long time to get to us. So when you see some of our docs, you know, they might talk to you about being part of some of these clinical trials and being part of uh, using some of these new therapies. And this is why we, we, you know, we ask you about it because this is the way to lead the field and to bring some of these new technologies because it helps us get access to some of the uh, advantages or, or, or some of the safety aspects.